Okay, careful, stay there. We have so many apples and we're gonna go visit Lola. And um, I just got done filming one of um, two, my second Sensi Flash sale haul. And then I have just one last flash sale box. I think, I kind of think I'm missing a box though, unless it's in there. Um, and and that, and, and yeah, and then I'll be done with the flash sale showing you guys. But Danica is gonna pick some apples for Lola. Yeah, go ahead. Pick whatever you want. Come first, come first. Hi, you got your money? Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> we, um, we're gonna go walk into um, World Market because we just dropped off Jonathan. Oh, I like this table. And then Target is just right there. I love this table. This is why I wanted um, the table that I have. Hubby and Jonathan made it for me and then I painted it because of rustic tables like these. Wow. Yay! So that table, um, $7.49. You know how much Jonathan and Hubby spent for the wood to make mine? About $80, $80 or $90 they said. And then I just, um, I just painted it. Let's go over here. They're putting out their, yeah, that's for the gravy, their Halloween decor, Halloween fall. <gasps> Oh, I've been wanting these to serve the turkey Mommy, in. Mom, your, oh my your goodness, plate, yeah. Mom, it's your plate. Yeah, my plate. I like you that. Know. They're just getting ready to, to prep it up. All right, let's go this way, love. Okay, I love William Sonoma because they have this brine that I always get for my turkeys. Yes. Nice, Danica. Oh look, they have brown mustard seed. That's nice. That's a nice collection. Because you only need this like really for the holidays. Yes. Yeah, cloves. Oh, thank you, Danica. Oh, I can't wait um, for them to finish it up. All right, let's go this way, love. They have fall stuff. So they put in more um, Christmas decoration than last week when we were here. So while Jonathan's in um, his uh, political science class, no wait, English 101 class, English 101, we like to walk around, Danica and I, so there's around his school area, there's World Market, Target, Whole Foods, oh, this is cute, mm -hmm. winter scene, um, lots of other stuff that we could walk around. Danica likes to window shop like me. Look, Danica, they have the, the ornaments and she has her, her birthday money. <laughs> She's only spent, I think, probably $9. Those are cute. Oh, garland, be merry garland. That's cute. Nice bell. Nice bell. How much is this one? Oh. Advent calendar. I like rustic trees like this with the rustic looking ornaments. I like sparkles too. She likes those ornaments. Come over here, love. I want to make a DIY of this, the ladder, the blanket ladder, so easy to make with um, the scrap of wood that I have downstairs. Come lovely! <laughs> She's so good to bring to stores. Ah, oh, this one. I kind of want this one. I have so much Christmas decor though. Yes, love. That is so cool. Oh, it's a fortune cookie. Kitty. A cookie. Mm hmm They're still starting to bring out their decors. Yeah, be gentle. Come this way, love. Yeah. It's a tin, so it's pretty loud. Oh, we're due for another stocking change. Mm. So over here at World Market for their cookie jars, they have a pug. Really cute. And then they have... um the tree last year I missed out because they had the the red truck the the same one that looks exactly like the um, 
the pumpkin delivery and the um, special delivery that I talked about with my Sensi, it was the red truck with the Christmas tree. Well, they had a world market version of that, like this, of a cookie jar. Should have gotten it, I missed out on it. Yeah, that's really pretty, this one. This one also, if you get this over here at World Market for the cookie jar for the holidays, this will also go well with the, um, we have the one, I think it's called Less Traveled um, Warmer. Hubby bought it, um, and it's the, the wagon, the, the camper that would go together. You like that, Danica? I've always been attracted to coppers ever since Martha. Introduce me to copper things, copper, beautiful copper things. Ooh, garlic. Here's a nice pineapple one. Yeah. Oh, it fit your finger. She said she wanted to go to Target and buy that cut, cut thing. She's been talking about this for like two weeks now, so I'm gonna take her. Are you ready to go to Target? Yeah. You have your your money. Oh, you, you put it in my purse? There you go. You ready? Let me know when you're ready. Yeah. That was amazing. That's going to drive me insane, friends. It drives me insane. But. She used her own money. You saw her. Little blue luggage of money. Danica, did you buy your toy? Yeah. I yeah. Did. That. Mm -hmm. I know. I know. Yeah. That thing's going to drive me crazy. Okay, well, I wanted to share with you guys. So, I barely put makeup on. I don't put makeup on anymore. I just don't have time. But if I do, it's like one dab of brush, and I'm like, I'm done. But today, because I was going to make a Scentsy video for you guys, and then I also made my um, cheese strudel recipe. I have that. And so I'm like, okay, shower, get ready, put on my makeup. But the reason, the reason, I'm just sharing with you guys because I'm just waiting in the car and I'm bored. The reason I don't put eyeliner on, and I haven't put eyeliner on in like maybe 10 years. Well, I do like when hubby and I are on a date, but I don't do it every day anymore. Because I don't know if it's because of my age. Because we know as we, I'm looking at like three mirrors. One, two, and then the camera. So I don't know what to focus on. My eyes are like, but uh, I don't know if it's because of age. But I can't put eyeliner on anymore. And you see close up you see that you see under like really I I have like saggy like saggy under eye skin that when <laughs> when I put eyeliner on it's like it makes like it's it's like all around yes my love Is she, oh hey did you did you have a good dream last night I I, I do wedges uh -huh. and puzzles. Oh, she dreamed of decorations and puzzles. She just had a lunchable. And puzzles. Oh, yeah. Nice. And you bought that with your own money? How much did that cost? Yeah, go sing. gonna drive me insane okay so that's why but oh friends okay I'm hoping but that by the time I upload this because I I do little snippets of vlog now not like the whole day because I think it's best our days are boring friends you don't want hold on sorry all right okay we had 45 minutes this is his second day shoot um, second change of outfit he did really awesome I got some really good nice shots and I think I'm going to also post it here when I finally enhance it and put it into a collage for him. It's his senior pics. How'd you do? Uh, you feel good? good yeah. yeah. And this is our view for the night. It was just right when we were um, came here at uh, 6 o'clock. Sorry. Um, train, sunset, 
fairy, tooth fairy. It was awesome. What do you think? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, I haven't shown you guys. Breathe. Oh yeah, your book. You don't forget your book. We also got his book as part of a prop. I told him he's lucky that his mom is a patient photographer. Like when I really photograph clients, it's more lifestyle than studio. I don't like studio. As much as there are beautiful studio photography, if the studio does not have good background, because some background could be nice and realistic and then they add some Photoshop into it. I'm more of a lifestyle. So this is our view right here. The clouds, the gray clouds, it was starting to drizzle. The ferry, there's another ferry there. Awesome, I loved it. Um, I'm gonna do another shoot for him. Maybe by this weekend, I wanna finish it up. And congratulations, Jonathan, college student. I'm so proud of him. You're my favorite. <laughs> I won't tell the girls. I always tell each one of them that they're my favorite, not tell the others. Hi, huh, Jonathan. Yeah. Okay, let's go, bud. Awesome. Awesome job. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I'm sorry. Uh, she stopped and then she knocked her head on my purse. But this is cute. About 59. 30% off. For this, yeah. Well, be gentle, gentle with it. Oh, those are cute. That one, Christmas tree farm mistletoe. Yeah. Oh, look at this truck. Oh, look at this one, Christmas tree farm. I don't care much for the. Oh, I don't like the the tree though, but I like the truck. Thirty nine ninety nine. Mm-hmm, that's an advent. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. I made a sign for a customer. I'm gonna make a sign for myself. Um, it's gonna be similar to that, but it's actually gonna have the farm, has the arrows with the truck. Very popular on the cutting cricket, cricket world. Mm -hmm. They have Ooh, old fashioned hot cocoa warm up. Baby, it's cold outside. Sign. Mrs. Claus Cookie Company. That's so cute, Danica. Oh, have a little pole. Reindeer Express. I just have so much Christmas stuff, so I don't want to buy any anything. Although I just bought a sign over at Walmart, but it was only like four dollars. Mm. Yes, love. Yes, I'll follow you. Mom, it's your doll. Oh yeah, and the oh I like this mailbox. Mom. Yeah. Okay. We have something similar to that. Careful. Oop, gentle. Um, it's, it's empty. Okay. Aloha friends, good morning. It is about seven in the morning. I wanted to show you our world. I don't know if the camera can pick it up, but the skies are absolutely gorgeous. It has a, like a glow orange. Is it orange glow to it from the, the sunrise? Sun is just coming out and look at all the beautiful trees. So there's an orange tree there. That those that red that red little plant there is a it's what we call Japanese maple and then she has another one there and that's more reddish but smaller that's a Japanese maple too um, that's beautiful it's like during the summer months if you guys can see the one I think she has two of them or half of that one it's like burgundy and then um, during the fall winter months it becomes like a like a ruby red Christmas red color and the trees are starting to change colors like a few weeks ago and they're absolutely beautiful now we have um, our own tree right here that's yellow it's beautiful when I look out my window my bedroom window and you can tell that the leaves are falling from the wind oh it's just gorgeous I'm gonna focus on that tree how gorgeous it is look at that Beautiful. I'm gonna show you guys the backyard, our cherry tree. All right, so this is the backyard. And 
This is our cherry tree. Huge cherry tree. This is our maple. Not pretty. It's all red and orange and yellow and green and light green and dark green. All swirl into one tree. Absolutely beautiful. And then see the clouds moving in. Pretty. Alright friends, we are going towards the evening. Um, I only vlogged a little bit, showed you guys our view of the fall view. But um, what did I do today? So I made a video today and used this camera. But I showed you guys how I, um, I cook my spinach artichoke dip. That's my go-to recipe. And then um, um, I did that. And then I picked up Jonathan late at school because he stayed over at the library. And then I made banana nut bread like about an hour and a half ago. It's still cooling. And I choose not to put nuts because so that the whole family can eat it, even Danica. And instead I, um, I use uh, chocolate chip cookies. So then the, the girls can pack it for school. They'll eat it for breakfast kind of thing. So I need to, um, I need to go back into the habit of making my, uh, my breads because sometimes I make the banana nut bread. Um, sometimes I'll do other, other baked goods that they pack for school. But also I wanted to share with you guys this. So this is the soda stream. Soda stream. And it's, it's a mechanism or a machine that doesn't require electricity. And what it is, is just a, um, I call it soda water. So we mostly have it for, um, for the fizz, the water fizz. And Danny, um, today is Wednesday. So Danny was like, hey, it's Wednesday. Can we have a soda water? So you can flavor it with these. Oh. It actually expires November 15th because I was going to tell you guys, this is the same um, flavored soda that we bought when we first bought this. And I think we've had this for about a year now. And, um, and that's it. We have this one and we had the, the grape one. So the grape is gone. This one's just a little bit left. But I want to make sure that they use it up before the 15th of November. But most... More than often, we just use it for just water. I just have the kids just do it with water. I don't like the the sugary syrup that they add with it, but the kids does, and so does hubby. But um, usually just water. And then what I like to do is just put a slice of lemon in there, and then it tastes like soda lemon water. And you can really taste the lemon in there just with that small slice. So that's what I like to do when I need my, uh, my fizz. And I'm going to cut into the banana bread. Jonathan is just doing work. This is another essay? Uh, yeah. Yeah. So with Jonathan, like, he's, he's going full-time college for his senior year. And then he has one class with the high school. And that is the Washington State uh, Social Studies. Is it Washington State Social Studies? What is it yeah, called? Washington yeah, Washington State History. Oh, Washington State History. And usually the kids take that during like 8th grade. But we moved in here when he was in 10th grade. So he missed out on that. So he has to take that. Other than that, he's not going into the high school whatsoever. Um, and that um, Washington State one is an online class. So he actually has to turn something in um, on Friday, right? So, oh, yeah. so he's been working on it since... Um, September when school started and then he'll turn it in on on Friday, but let me show you guys our house Danica was playing which is nice because then the TV's off and um, I had to take Danny to Volleyball she took her pictures. We had a visitor over baby Jack. Oh, he's so adorable. I love we love our baby Jack So he's our neighbor. He came over to play for a bit. I've got my last package in from the flash sale so i still have one to upload and i'm hoping that i'm i can upload that one with the um with the artichoke recipe because um i am doing the sensi but that's not gonna be like a full-time thing it's only because i bought so much stuff and then i also bought some for my neighbors as well and i wanted to show you guys so there's some in, stuff in there so i wanted to show you that and then i wanted to also let you guys know I film how I decorated my mantle 
this is this the broomstick from Trader Joe's. It's still there. Get it. It's three ninety nine. I can still smell it. I have um I have ice pine in here. So it's funny because I have my two um give thanks like um what is it called that fall and Halloween theme. But then the house smells like Christmas. Like it's a Christmas tree farm. I love this um, ice pine. It's if you want your home to smell like Christmassy. That's the scent to buy. I like it when I see this mess because that means my Danica was playing and not being a couch potato. So here is my mantle. I showed you guys this on the one video that I made and somebody moved it. This would be my children or maybe it just slid. I shouldn't blame my children all the time. But that is cute, simple. This was a uh, dollar spot over at Target. Dollar spot at Target. This was at the Dollar Tree. That one was just from a, a tree, a tree branch. And this one is dollar spot last year from, those were last year. Dollar spot from Target last year. Dollar spot, Dollar Tree. So one, two, three, four, five, six, six dollars. But I think this was three. I have a feeling that was three. Yeah, that's it. Simple, like simple. I can't believe that November 1st is coming up uh, next weekend. So the kids are going to go trick-or-treating. Danielle has a Halloween party. Jonathan, are you going to a Halloween party? Um, maybe not hmm. sure. Maybe not sure. So, um, but the little girls are going trick-or-treating for a little bit. And that's it. So this is our house. Somebody asked, can you, can I film my house. I think I did a little video. Maybe I can add that on to this vlog because I don't really have much content. Um, I, I don't vlog as much anymore. It's just because of the kids, um, the girls, my little girls, um, privacy issue. But um, the big kids, they're, they're not home. So I feel bad when I'm always like showing Danica, but Danica's always with me and then um, and then partly also because, well, I show you guys, I still vlog when I'm like going out with Danica. But when I'm home, it's because I'm, I'm busy with, with the kids running around. So hubby made spaghetti, which was really good. I made artichoke dip for snack. And then the na I also shared some with our neighbors. And then um, just trying to tidy up. I don't even have time to just sit down and do the laundry, um, which I need to. Ooh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, it's dried up. So yeah, um, oh here's my front door. Somebody also asked, can you film your front door decor? This is it for my front door. Ooh, this one, oh wow. So we had a strong win. Um, I just put that up there. Oh, that's it, welcome. Kind of crooked right now, but it's okay. I think it's still good, maybe there, there. There, welcome, cutie, welcome. And this is my pumpkin. I actually fixed them up again. I put E6000 super glue and it worked out really great. My harvest pumpkins here, that was from Costco when Jonathan was born. So that's 17 years old. It's now, it used to be nice and copper, but I've left it outside. So it's now like rusted in color, very vin vintage looking. And then I bought these over at like Michael's for like four dollars but I did I never took out the plastic so I've been using it year round this is my second year of using it so if you guys want to save all money on that just don't take out the plastic uh, reuse it this one remember how I told you guys how it um, came undone so I just staple gunned it it works fine <laughs> uh, and then I have my um, wreath that I got on clearance from Joann's so I like to get my wreaths at Joann's when they have a nice nice sale oh I can smell my banana bread I was gonna say Jonathan did we take it out of the oven um as you guys can tell over there I still have to put pictures there <laughs> uh I I still have to do finish up the homecoming pics uh that I did of uh, Danielle and her friend all right our home smells amazing um I have ice pine here on both and then but um on my studio I just did a haul for you guys of my last flash sale haul I have my frosted ginger and it smells amazing oh you want ice cream yeah yeah you can have some put those back first right. we are chilling today a lazy day because 
I just did a video and she's just, I cleaned it up, but then she just wants to play. Okay, go ahead and go get some, open it. And then um, it's a sunny day. So my neighbors are working on their lawn and then I have my um, stuff out. Yeah, see? So, whoa. How are you, baby? Oh, uh oh, are you too cold? Okay, I'm gonna bring you inside. Yes, my love. Okay, you gotta use, you are my love. Yeah, oh my goodness. See, I'm always wiping it. That's the hard thing with having the, ask Kuya. Ask Kuya. So, friends? Yeah. Help. Say, please, Koo. It's early morning still. Um, cleaning up the kitchen. Just did a video. And then her favorite ice cream. You want to show our friends? You want to show our friends your favorite ice cream? Be careful. Yes, her favorite ice cream. It's all right. It's fine. You go close it. You did your best. Um, Minnie, hold the cone from Trader Joe's. I think this is $1.99, but there is, what, how many? Eight? And it's a perfect size. Can you show them, Danica? She, she was um, painting, actually, so she has her painting clothes on. Perfect size for Danica. Yeah, it's a good, nice treat, like, like that small. So I'm going to clean my kitchen. Jonathan, you going to have one? Okay, sure. Yeah, Jonathan's going to have one. Um, oh, yeah, okay. Is this where you play though? <laughs> um, I just drank, finished drinking my chai, spice chai tea latte from Trader Joe's. And then I made this. I showed you guys how I made this last night. It is still uh, late morning, but friends, it's gone. Both girls packed it for lunch. Hub, hubby probably had some this morning and then they all had it last night for the um, dessert. Um, this is my chocolate chip uh, banana bread.